How's it going, everybody? Cody with Level Up Games here, and I'm joined by John, who is going to help walk us through the diff seven different rarities found in the Yu-Gi-Oh! Rarity Collection. So, John, get us on the way. Yeah, of course. So, what's up, guys? Um, pretty happy to be here showing you this awesome product. So, um, as he did mention, there are seven new rarities that do come in the Rarity Collection. This, of course, being a one that we already have in the game, we're pretty uh, familiar with, being the Super Rare. Um, the card we're chosen today is Reinforcement of the Army, because this card is um, one of the most iconic in the game. So, um, Super Rare's always kind of been in the game, just hollow, no special name treatment or anything of that sort. Um, we then move to the Ultra Rare, um, much like the Super Rare, hollow name, but or hollow picture, but it does have that gold-enforced name up there. Um, once again, it's been in the game for a while, so that's a pretty sweet one. Uh, the classic, I believe, uh, the first non-speed duel print of Secret for Reinforcements of the Army. Um, Secret Rare has that iconic line scratch rarity that um, we've come to know and love, and this card looks absolutely beautiful in it. Um, and now we're going to go into some of the rarities that are coming back or are new um, to this set. So this here is the Platinum Secret Rare Reinforcements of the Army. So, Platinum Rares were first introduced in the game back in 2015 in the Mega Tens, and they brought them back revamped. Um, they're no longer as glossy. They don't really look like, almost like Starlet Rares, but they have this really cool etched border, um, as well as, uh, it's kind of weird to see on the camera, but the name does shift colors and rarity. So, um, the revamp of these look insane. Uh, absolutely a huge fan of those. Um, one other thing they have brought back, 25th anniversary of Yu-Gi-Oh! this year. So, uh, core century rares are available in this set for every single card. Um, this being the uh, reinforcements of the army, of course, with that little 25th embossed uh, stamp down there. It's got the whole card covered in a very, very shiny uh, foiling. Absolutely beautiful card. And the two new exclusive rarities to the core century or to the um, rarity collection. So, here is the um, ultimate rare, the new. Uh, oh, what was the... I can't remember. Sorry. I believe that is the Prismatic... Prismatic Ultimate Rare. Thank you, Cody. Sorry. I wanted to say Primum, but that is not the word. It is Prismatic. Um, they've went with a new style of Ultimate here. Instead of the classic more embossed, the card is actually kind of sticking out like the art. It looks absolutely beautiful. I mean, if, we've never had something like this in the TCG. This card looks absolutely crazy. And the, the actual... Like, frame of the card is also kind of etched out. It looks absolutely wild. I'm a huge fan of these. I think they did an insane job. And then, also in the Prismatic Treatment, we have the Prismatic Collector Rare. So I get this to focus here. So it has that classic shatter foil effect around the edges. Um, but what makes these different is it has these almost dual terminal-esque sparkles on them. It makes it look absolutely just crazy like in person i can't even explain how beautiful these look but they are absolutely beautiful once again any and every card in the set comes like this um you can get any of them in any of these rarities and uh you know ash blossom baron stuff of that it's absolutely crazy all right so obviously we went through all seven different rarities and it's kind of wild that every single card in the set does come in each of these rarities uh what's what would you say is probably the biggest one that people are keeping an eye out for right now? Oh, it's for sure Ash Blossom and um, Joyous Spring. The Core Century Rare specifically, people are, I'm going well for it, is the highest rarity of Ash Blossom as well as the uh, just most sought after card in the game right now. I mean, Ash Blossom has been a staple since its release and doesn't seem to be slowing down anytime soon. All right, fantastic. Well, guys, let us know in the comments if you agree with that or if there's something else that you're trying to keep an eye out for. Obviously, we still have plenty of boxes left in stock, so be sure to swing by and pick them up while we still have them. Other than that, thanks for watching, guys, and we'll catch you later.